Hi guys, Tristan here for Amazulu, and we're going to talk a little bit about rope and netting. Now we've all seen rope and netting in water parks, theme parks, maybe some nautical themed restaurants. That's great. Phenomenal application. But it's overlooked in some other areas too. So I wanted to talk just a little bit about that. Let's take a look at some of the more traditional applications of rope and netting. Bridges. You have that wrapped rope, the lashing, the netting, it just automatically evokes a feel. At a restaurant, you know, you could put up a chain link fence or a wood fence, but the rope and netting just automatically creates a mood. Same here, look at this one. Absolutely beautiful. It's art. And it's a great accent when you want to add that sort of tiki or rustic look to a wood frame structure. This, believe it or not, is synthetic rope. Pretty much nowadays, most of the rope and netting you see is synthetic. Why? Well, jute rope will fray over time. The UV wears it down. The, the physical contact with it wears it down. This, okay, this is polypropylene on the inside. It's wrapped in nylon and polyester. This stuff is indestructible. UV, weather, time, even fire. This doesn't burn. It will melt at 490 degrees, but I'm thinking if it's 490 degrees, you're thinking other things than, hey, my rope is melting. An incredibly solid, wonderful product. Comes in colors. Now this gets in, if you're designing an area for kids or a theme park or a play area in a restaurant or a daycare and you're thinking, what can we put in there? There's netting that's rated for kids to walk on it. It's rated for impact, whatever you need. As always, just give us a call. We're happy to talk about it. We'll talk about your project, what you're looking to do, what you need to accomplish, what the local zoning ordinances are and safety requirements. We've got the netting for you. Let's just look at a few pictures of some really fun applications. Look at this rope bridge. It's colorful and it's actually rated for people to walk on it. Water parks, and it doesn't have to be a water park, but hopefully this is getting your mind going thinking, you know, I can probably stick some netting in a place where I was just gonna maybe have a blank wall or a normal divider. Rope and netting. It's not just for nautical anymore. Thanks for watching.